Hello everyone and welcome to Chat with Nene Alice. And if you this is your first time tuning in to Chat with Nene Alice, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to send in your comments because together we can all improve on this channel. Well viewers, Chat with Nene Alice has turned one. We are one year today and we are so happy and excited. Round of applause. <laughs> Again, I want to say we are here supporting Leon Stars because we are going to be part of the African Cup of Nations. And I want to say to Leon Stars, bring home the cup. We need the cup here in Sierra Leone. So all the best and best wishes as we go to Cameroon. Okay. So I want to say thank you to my team, Yata and DJ. They have been my strongest support in this one year of Chat with Nene Alice. I want to say thank you very much. Yata has, um, has been my wardrobe, my makeup artist, and um, everything. And DJ has been the producer who has been working behind the scenes in improving some of the videos that we put, for, put out. So I want to say thank you. I also want to say thank you to our viewers, those of you who have been watching me consistently, and those of you who have been sending in your comments, I say thank you from the depth of my heart. I appreciate you so much. Yes, and I'm also here, and I'm going to ask my team, Yata and DJ, you know, to ask me questions about the channel so far. Yeah, okay. Um, hello, viewers. Okay, mommy, um, I wanted to ask, um, what is your favorite um, highlight so far? Okay, my highlight has been the guest. People who have been able to come to this show to share their own perspective and people who have graced the, the show and people who have been giving me feedback. Some people have not been able to come to the show, but they, they have been sending me feedback for improvements. All of that I have taken into, I have taken note of and we have tried to improve the show. Hello viewers. Um, Mama, I just want to ask, who are your top guests and are you having any plans on bringing on um, male guests in the show? Okay, so my top guests, I have three. And the criteria for choosing those three guests, guests is because they gave me more subscribers, they gave me more views, and I had more comments when those three group of people graced my stage. The first one has to do with Dr. Nimata. And with Dr. Nimata, we talked about how women can get involved into political parties. And that conversation was so interesting. I had lots of viewers, and I had lots of sub subscribers, and I had lots of people sending in their comments concerning that particular conversation. The other one was with Dr. Honorable, um, Honorable Dr. Bernadette Lahai. Honorable Dr. Bernadette Lahai, we talked about women getting into politics. You know, and that was so interesting. I had lots of viewers, I had lots of subscribers, and I had lots of feedback when Honorable Dr. Bernadette Lai graced my stage. The other one has to do with um, um, Anwo and Jenny, where we talked about um, how we how we can be mothers and various, you know aspects about being a mother, how we can talk to our kids, how we can be very good mother-in-laws, how we can be role models for our children. And that was also another exciting session. And there are others too. You, the other session that I did with, deal, dealt with um, how to be a mother, a career woman and a wife, where I had Finde Kwiwa, I had um, Elizabeth Amara and Elfrida uh, and found, Brahma Faundu when they came. You know, those sessions were so you know, electrifying. I had lots of subscribers, lots of viewers, and I was so happy about those. Wow. So, Mama, is there any plans of you bringing on male guests on the show? Well, yes, I have my first male guest, <laughs> my son, who is here. <laughs> yes, we have plans to come with male guests to this show. And um, we're starting this um, 2022, we'll be bringing in some male guests to share perspective, their own perspective about how they can help us to end violence against women, how they can help us, you know, us getting us more policies and more legislation that would advance women's rights. And now together we can all end violence against women. So I have plans to come with male guests. Okay, and Mama, I wanted to ask, um, I know viewers want to know that um, in this one year, if um, all the guests 
let's see if you bite it. If they have um, appeared, they um, so far. Okay. Well, I will say 90% of the people that I have invited have showed up. They came and they were happy to be part of the show. And 10% did not show up. But those 10%, I will not give up on them. I will also reach out to them in this, in this coming year. In 2022, I will reach out to them and ensure that they come. Are you expecting sponsors? Are you expecting sponsors? Well... It's open to sponsors, and um, what I think I will do is to develop proposals, um, to reach out to uh, you know business agencies so that they can come and give give me support. I also intend to go on TV and radio to have live shows. So I really want people to come on board and support me. Anything is good for that. So nothing is too small. Every little helps. Okay, um, so Mama, I know. Also, the viewers want to know that um, some of um, the challenges, some of the shortcomings that you've encountered so far during this one year. Okay. One of my biggest challenge has been, um, you know, getting a proper studio. I've been, I've been challenged with that and I've tried a lot, you know, to improve on the studio so that I will have very good light, light. I will have a very good sound so that I will not be having disruptions. But the thing is, I like outdoor shootings. So because of that, I need to improve on the quality of mic, you know, and you know, and all of that. The other one has to, to do with, um, with um, us, you know, sticking to, to a particular time in, a particular time in giving out the videos. Monday, every Monday, we have agreed that we should be putting out those videos. But sometimes, because of internet connectivity, we have had challenges, you know, in, you know, in downloading, in editing, and all of that. But all of that we will try to improve on as we, you know, continue to do the recordings for 2022. Another one has been like, my daughter asks if I have sponsors. I do not have sponsors, but my family have been giving me all the sponsorship that I need so far. And I really need people to sponsor so that I can improve on my studio and then I can go live in communities and I'll go live on TV and, um, and, and radio as well. And also, Mama, were you expecting the amount of subscribers that you have now? Well, in terms of subscribers, I was thinking by now I should have, you know, hit 1,000 subscribers. But I'm still struggling with that. I'm getting closer to 700, which is good. And thanks to those who have subscribed. Thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. I appreciate you. But please don't forget you have to subscribe. Because when you subscribe, you have value to the, to the videos. And then YouTube can recognize me the more. Okay. And then, Mama, um, well, I know um, you've seen so many comments um, in the comment section. So um, what are the comments that... Uh, that's the most inspiring to you and that keeps you going okay most of the comments so far have been um you know motivation you know some people do not write it on youtube but they send personal messages to me and they those messages have been very motivational to me some people have said thank you for the good job some people have said keep on go keep going some people have said you are very consistent some people have said i like the show some people have said the, the topics are so interesting and i want to say thank you for all those who have been sending comments on the flip side i've been having comments um from other people who are who are, who are cyber bully cyber bullies some people instead of just sending me comments they've been sending me nude photos they've been sending me nude comments They've been making love advances to me to say, I like you, I want you to be my wife, or you are my wife, or you know, and stuff like that. And some will not go direct to YouTube to send, some will send it via, uh, by a, uh, by a Facebook and via the other social medias that we do operate. And, you know, in as much as that, um, that's, you know, puts, puts me down or breaks my zeal, but I have tried to be very resilient so that I progress with my show and those comments do not put me down at all. So I want to appeal to people who have been sending me nude, nude um, photos or nude comments that please, please, please stop it and don't do it again. Um, whenever you post in a new video, what are the expectations of the, of the viewers compared to the subscribers? Well, well, according to YouTube analysis, some people do not watch till the end of the video, but then the fact that they have viewed the video 
it gives me views you know it's add to my views but i want to also encourage people to um you know to watch the old the old video because the thing is we're trying to make it very short and those are interesting topic and you know sometimes when you cut down so many things some sometimes the the main ingredients you know you will just get lost but for those who have been viewing thank you for viewing and i want you to keep viewing my videos and please as you view don't forget to also hit the like button if you like it okay and another thing i want to say is that i have never gotten a dislike for my videos you know, most of the times, you know, people give me thumbs up to show that they like. So I'm very, very much happy about that. So, Mama, we jo we want to. Um, I personally want to say thank you because of the motivational um, videos you are doing, and you are giving so much. You are giving now so much impact to young girls and even married women out there. I just want to say thank you and continue the good work. Thumbs up for you, Mama. Thank you. <laughs> Um, I for one, we uh, want to say that um, this journey um, to start up a channel has been for a while now and I'm very happy that mom has, um, has been able to accomplish that and also that um, she has been able to inspire um, others um, so that they will be aware about um, what is going on around them. So thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I also want to say we are in, I am in my um, Leonster's um, jersey because I am a big time football fan and I want to root for Leonster's because we are going for the African Cup of Nations. So if you are a Sierra Leonean, please wish them luck and please Leonster's come home with the cup. We need the cup. Come home with it. Thank you. And I want to say thank you very much to everyone who have been gracing my stage and all those who have been viewing my videos and those who have been sending me comments and likes. Thank you so much. And I wish you a very, very blessed and prosperous 2022. Best wishes and stay tuned to chat with Nene Alice. If this is your first time tuning in, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to send in your comments. Thank you so much. Thank you.